for decades, mathematics has been the bedrock of the world's greatest innovations. We believe that we too can set indelible footprints in the sands of technology if we invest in our children and in their future, knowing fully well that from amongst them can come the next best innovators. Tomorrow's Einstein, Maria Mayers, Ayodele Awojobi, Philip Emeagwani. Yes, we have a dream that our children can be great. Since 2001, Cowbell has been on the front line promoting mathematics as a means to empowering young people and nourishing their dreams, harnessing their potential, irrespective of their background or ethnicity. Yes, we believe in our children, in their greatness, in what they can be. Reach for the stars with Nourishing Cowbell. Great to have you join us on yet another episode of Cowbellpedia, the number one mathematics TV quiz competition for secondary schools across Nigeria. It's yet another preliminary round in season three, and it's been quite an interesting and exciting journey. Two of our champions went to South Africa, as promised. It was the educational excursion. Another two from the 108 this season will have their shot at going somewhere special, along with one million naira, a laptop, and prizes for their schools. Who will it be? That's what we're here to find out. I am Oscar, your quiz master, and of course, a big shout out to Ramassador, the sponsors and the makers of Cowbell R Milk, and this program is endorsed by Neko. I'll be back to meet the first six contestants in the senior and junior category. Instantly dissolving cowbell milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita-Rich, plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, deliciously creamy. Welcome back. We are going to meet the first six contestants in the junior category. They have been quite impressive in finding their way to this very stage. Over 52,000 applications from 10,000 schools and we're left with the best of the best 108, 54 in the junior and 54 in the senior category. Let's meet our first six contestants in the junior category. My name is Kola Oli Bankoli Andrew from Greater Tomorrow International College, Arigidi Akoko, Ondo State. How are you doing, Kola Oli? Fine, sir. Thank Great you. to have you on board. Thank you, sir. Um, before you heard about Cowbellpedia, what were you doing in school to just entertain yourself, or should I say, practice your maths or display your skills? I take first in mathematics or either second in mathematics examination. You're always either first or second? Yes, sir. Very impressive. When you heard the news, um, how, how did you react to it? I was happy, I was excited. Did you think you were going to score that high? I was expecting more than that. 100 over 100? Yes. And myself. you've done that before? This was my first time in participating in Kabepedia written exam. And this might not be your last time, considering you could still represent your school in the senior category. Wish you all the best, Bawale. Great Thank to have you, you on board. Myself. Contestant number two. I'm George Dochuk. I am Josh Dochui from Rui Pekula College, Jalingo, Taraba State. 
George, great to have you on board. How are you feeling today? Excited. Have you made new friends since you've been here? Only my roommates. Well, who's your roommate? M Usman Musa. What have you learned about your roommate? He's not a troublesome person. He's a quiet boy. He's not a, <laughs> he's not a troublesome person. <laughs> Can you name one troublesome person you know? Adashu. Adachu. Is he very good in maths? No. Is a boy or a girl? A boy. He likes playing. He likes to play. <laughs> and you don't like to play? I like playing, but I don't like to play too much. You don't like to play. You like to solve maths. Well, I wish you all the best. Glad to have you on board, George. Contestant number three. My name is Brie Tamnokura from Greater International School for Tarko River State. How are you doing, Tamano? Fine, thank you. What are your hobbies? Um, I like watching movies and listening to music. And you like swinging from side to side. <laughs> I'm always thinking maybe you're about to rap or something. <laughs> what kind of movies do you like watching? All. Old movies? All, all. Oh, all movies? Yes. Well, do you remember the last movie you watched? Um, Maximum Ride. Okay, do you like action or yeah. romance? Action. Action, and action B. <laughs> we'll see how much action you have as you find your way to the finals. Welcome, glad to have you on board. Contestant number four. My name is Soko Omamude from Graceville High School, Okpanam, Delta States. Omamude, how are you doing? I'm fine. How about you now? Day inside clothes. So, what do you do at home when you're not solving math questions? I watch TV and I talk to my brothers and play games. What? Your father, right? Yes. He he's what? What does he do for a living? He's now he's retired. He's retired. Yes. What was he doing? He's doing a, a radio business, a radio station business. Okay, what was your, 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 your father's favorite food? Well, what is it? Um, he likes swallow. Swallow? Yes. What type? Um, eba. Eba. Yes. Which type do you like? I like eba too. If there are two pieces of meat in his plate, is it the type that will give you the two if you ask for him? Yes. He'll give you both pieces of meat? Yes. Will you give your brothers your pieces of meat? I might. You might? I like that, honesty. Anyway, I wish you all the best and I hope you make it all the way to the finals. Great to have you on board. Yes. Contestant number five. My name is Ekane Ezekiel from Advanced Comprehensive College, Shagamugu State. Ezekiel, welcome to Cowbellpedia. Thanks, sir. Do you ever think of doing something else outside mathematics or outside the sciences? Maybe being a... <laughs> journalist or... Oh, being a journalist. Okay. Do you, do you like working maybe like newspaper or radio or TV? I prefer TV. TV. So you like to be a quiz master one day, maybe. <laughs> I wish you all the best, Ezekiel. Welcome Thanks. to Cowboypedia. Contestant number six. My name is Henry Wogge from Tuapos College, Ebony State. How are you doing, Henry? Fine. You two, you scored 97? No, 91. 91. Is that your highest score so far? For Kabelpedia, that is. For, Ka <laughs> For Kabelpedia, that is. Do you have intentions of coming back in the senior category? Yes. All right. How many people know that you're here from your school? Almost half of the school. Uh, what about the other half? What happened? They, they're not informed. I wish you all the best, Henry. Welcome to Kabelpedia. Thank you, Quizmaster. Master. There we have our six contestants about to take that first step. We're moving into two rounds. Round one is 12 questions. You have five seconds to give your answer. At the end of round one, the top three students with the highest scores move into round two, which is the Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame. At the end of that round, the top two students with the highest scores move on to the semi-final. I wish you all the best. Are you all ready? Yes, quiz master. Yes, quiz master. Yes, master. master. Do you have any questions? No, quiz no, master. master. Let's move on straight to round one. Wish you all the best. Question number one. A man gave 1,000 naira to a cashier and collected 36 naira change. How much did he spend? A, 934, 964, 944, or 956 naira? The correct answer is B, 964 Naira. Well done to all of you. You are on very good start. <laughs> so
Simplify, minus one and a half times three, two over three, A, five, one over two, three, two over three, minus three, two over three, and D, minus five, one over two. I think this is the first time in a very long time I'm seeing this kind of spread of answers. We had one correct answer, but for some reason, Five of you didn't put in the answer in time. I've not seen this in a while. Time or not, well done to you for getting that correct. What happened, guys? What happened? Henry, what happened? I was not fast enough. It's all good. Not to worry. Let's move on to question number three. The game is still on. It's still anybody's game. Add 110 base 2 to 101 base 2. A, 110101 base 2, 1001 base 2, 1011 base 2, and D, 1101 base 2. The correct answer is C, 1011 base 2. Let's move on to question number 4. A drum holds 100 liters of water. The capacity of a bucket is 5 liters. How many buckets of water does the tank hold? A, 35, B, 20, C, 32, and D, 28. The correct answer is 20. Option B. Amamode, what's your answer? B. Do you fetch water at home? Yes. In school? Yes. Do you like it? No. Well done to all of you. You all got it right. The correct answer is B. <laughs> Moving on to question number five. Find the sum of 1, 1 over 3 and 2, 2 over 3. 4, 1, 2 and D, 3. The correct answer is option A, which is number four. We have three correct, two incorrect. Henry, you need to put in your answer in time. Question number six. Sum the positive difference of these numbers with their product, 15 and five. A, 750, 85, 700, and D, 80. The correct answer is B. 85. Oh, Mamade, well done to you. Halfway through. We'll be back after the break. Six more questions, three contestants for round two. Very, very close call on the score sheet. Stick around on Cowboy Pedia. <laughs> Choco formula has been stolen. Get it back at all costs. Tasting new Carbell Choco gives you the get up and go to be at the top of your game. Now with Vitorich Plus Iron. New great tasting Carbell Choco, a creamy chocolatey drink that helps give energy to get up and go. Welcome back. Now, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. That's youtube.com forward slash Cowbellpedia TV Nigeria to update yourself on all the episodes of Cowbellpedia. Well done to each and every one of you. Let's move on to question number seven. If three is multiplied by its multiplicative inverse, the result is nine minus six, one minus one over three. The correct answer is C, which is 1, 
Moving on to question number eight. The sum of Q and three is divided by eight is three Q over four, Q plus three over eight, three Q over eight, and Q minus three over eight. Correct answer is B, Q plus three over eight. We had four correct, two incorrect. It's a very tight call. Please, you need to pay attention to the questions, but more importantly, make sure you get them right. It's a very, very tough competition this is. Make B the subject of the formula if minus B plus C minus D is zero. A, C minus D, C plus D, D plus C, or D, D minus C. The correct answer is option A, C minus D. Two correct answers from Henry and Tamuna. Well done to both of you. We have a clear leader so far, but it's still anybody's game. Question number 10. Eight was added to three times a certain number. If the result is 23, what is the number? A, four, B, five, two, or D, three? The correct answer is option B, which is five. George Omamode, better luck with question number 11. If A over five is equal to three A over B, then B is equal to two A, 18, B, 15, C, 19, and D, 21. Correct answer is B, 15. We had four correct. George, you need to speed up with putting in your answer. This next question will determine who moves on to round two, who stays, or possibly we might have a tie. Simplify, three bracket N minus one times 60. A, 180N minus one, 180N minus 90, 180N plus 90, and D, 180N minus 180. I'm happy to say that at the end of this round, you all finished with a good score. You all got that particular question right. I told you it was a very tight one, but let's find out the scoreboard. And these are our top scores. And it seems we might be going into a tie. First and foremost, congratulations to Tamura and Ezekiel. You're on 50 and 45 points, so you have automatically made it to round two. Well done. On 20 points and 30 points, we have Kolawale and George. Your journey at this junction stops on Cowbellpedia. Hope to see you again, hopefully, in the senior category. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause to them. Well done. <laughs> now, out of um, Omamade and Henry, we want to find out who will join Tamara and Ezekiel. Because this is a tie, I'm going to ask three questions. Speed is also a useful ally in this particular tiebreak. We're looking for the most correct answers in the quickest times. Whatever you score in your tiebreak will not be added to your overall score. This is just to break the tie. Omama Day and Henry, I wish you all the best. You're both on 40 points. Let's play the tiebreak. Factorize 5QP plus 5P. A, 10P bracket Q plus one, 6P bracket Q plus one, 5p bracket q plus 1 or 5p bracket q minus 1. The correct answer is C, 5p bracket q plus 1. And I'm glad to say that you're both off to a very strong start. You both got it right. Well done. 
Simplify k over 4a plus p over 3a, a, 3k plus 4pa over 12a, 3k plus 4p over 12a, kp over 12a squared, or k minus p over a. Remember, speed and accuracy is a great ally at this point. Henry, what was your answer? B. B? I really wish you had the time to put that answer in. Unfortunately, your five seconds ran out. None of you got that particular question right. Correct answer is B, 3K plus 4P over 12A. Let's move on to question number three. This is a very decisive question. Solve 2x plus 9 is greater than or equal to 7. A, x is greater than or equal to minus 1, greater than or equal to minus 2, less than or equal to 1, or less than or equal to minus 2. Correct answer is A. X is greater or equals to minus 1. And you both got it right. <laughs> Who will be joining Ezekiel and Tamuno in round two? You're both on two points, but let's see what the average response time shows. Henry, you fought a good fight. What the computer is telling me is that your average response time was not as good as that of Omamade, which means he moves on to the next round. The ladies, a round of applause to Henry. Well done, and we wish you all the best. After that tie break, we're heading straight into the Carbopedia 60 Seconds of Fame. Speed and accuracy, as you can see, can be your friend, can be an ally, can also be your worst enemy if you do not have it on your side. This round is about speed, accuracy. Please remember that whatever you scored in your tiebreak will not be added to your overall score. Tamano, you're on 50 points. Ezekiel, 45 points. Omamade, you are on 40 points. Wish you all the best. I'm going to kick off with Tamuno. Your Carbopedia 60 Seconds of Fame starts now. What is 2 raised to the power 0 times 2 raised to the power 1? 2. Correct. Find the HF of 9, 15, and 45. 3. Correct. What is 150 Kobo in Naira? 1 Naira 5 Kobo. 1 Naira 50 Kobo. Correct. 1 over 2 raised to the power 3 can also be written in index form as? 1 over 8. Incorrect. What is the square of 21? 4 for 1. Correct. Evaluate 6,000 divided by 3 over 2. Um, 4,000. Correct. What is the value of 3 raised to the power 1 over 27. Correct. SA bought 3 dozens of pencils at... Skip! What is 0 0.000... 4.17 times 10 raised to the power minus 4. Correct. Convert 2% into a... 1 over 50. Correct. Evaluate 3... Skip! Make R the subject of the formula. 100 over PT. 100 I over PT. Correct. What is the prime factors of 48? 2, 3... Correct. Express 15 Naira as a percentage of 50 Naira. 30%. Correct. What is the value of 100 all raised to the power 2? 100,000. Incorrect. <laughs> well done. Whew. Ezekiel, are you ready? Yes, kids, master. You're on 45 points. I wish you all the best. Your Carbopedia 60 seconds of fame starts now calculate 10 raised to the power 2 times 25 2500 uh, two, uh, correct a boy has 200 naira and buys two books of the same price if he has four naira left 40 naira left how much does each book cost 18 naira correct calculate minus 2 plus plus, plus 4 one, plus plus, plus 7 plus, plus minus nine. 9 zero correct Correct. 756.1. Incorrect. Express 0 0.1. 1.67 times 10 to the minus 3. Correct. Hexadecimal numbers Base are. 16. No Correct. Express 225 as a product of its prime. 2, two is to power, 5 is to power 2. Incorrect. 
Express 9.8. 9.9. Incorrect. What is the additive inverse of one minus six? Three? Minus six over twenty-three. Incorrect. Find the amount if the interest is ninety naira on a principal of two hundred naira. One one ten. Incorrect. Express three point five one seven to three. Three point five two. Correct. The temperature inside a freezer is minus ten degrees Celsius. If temperature falls by twenty-two degrees Celsius, what is the new temperature? Thirty-two degrees Celsius. Incorrect. <laughs> well done. That was minus 32. Well done. Amamode, you ready? Yes, please, Master. Wish you all the best. You're on 40 points. Your Calvalpedia, 60 seconds of fame start now. Evaluate 3 over 2 divided by 2 over 3. 1. Incorrect. Evaluate 6 over 7 divided by 1 over 21. If you do not know, you can skip. 126 over 3. Incorrect. Find the next term of the sequence, 1 over 25, 1 over 16, 1 over 9. 1 over 3. Incorrect. Simplify t over 3 plus t over 4. Silence in the audience, please. Seven t over 12. Correct. If three cars are required to take 15 students to a debate, how many cars are required to take 30 students? Six. Correct. Solve for x in 7 minus x over 3 is equals to 1. S equals 4. Correct. Simplify 2A plus 3B minus B. 2A plus 2B. Correct. Well done. First, second, and third. First position has 105 points. Second, 75 points. Third, 60 points. I can tell you for free that we do have a female in the semi-finals. Well done, Tamina. You scored 105 points. And I can tell you for free, we have a male in the semi-finals. Ezekiel, you scored and note that there's only 15 points difference. You scored 15 points more than Omomade, which means you scored 60 points. Ezekiel, you're making it to the semi-final. Well done. Omomade, this means this is where your journey ends. Sorry to say this, but it's not the end. It's the beginning. And I wish you all the best. Very proud of how far you've come. And I hope to see you representing your school in the senior category. All the best. Congratulations to Ezekiel and Tamano. Ezekiel, how are you doing? I do not do well. I do not do well. Don't worry, you can prepare for the semi-finals. Be calm, be collected, you did very well. Tamano, you also did very, very well. 105 points, that's a good score. Anything you would like to do differently in the semi-finals? Yes. Congratulations. And there we have our two semi-finalists from the junior category. After the break, we'll meet our six contestants in the senior category as they take that first step towards the undisputed bragging rights, the crown, the 2017 Cowboypedia Mathematical Champion. Stick around. For decades, Mathematics has been the bedrock of the world's greatest innovations. We believe that we too can set indelible footprints in the sands of technology if we invest in our children and in their future, knowing fully well 
that from amongst them can come the next best innovators. Tomorrow's Einstein, Maria Mayers, Ayodele Awojobi, Philip Emeagwani. Yes, we have a dream that our children can be great. Since 2001, Cowbell has been on the front line promoting mathematics as a means to empowering young people and nourishing their dreams, harnessing their potential, irrespective of their background or ethnicity. Yes, we believe in our children, in their greatness, in what they can be. Reach for the stars with Nourishing Cowbell. Welcome back. Now, in as much as I congratulate a lot of our contestants, I'd like to also congratulate those of you at home. Judging by the answers I've been getting, you guys are not doing too bad. Here's our home play question for this week. The sum of the interior angles of any n-sided convex polygon is expressed by which formula? A. n minus 2 times 90 degrees. B. n minus 4 times 180 degrees. C. n minus 2 times 180 degrees. D. n minus 5 times 180 degrees. Be part of the Cowbellpedia Best 11. Type SC, space, your name, space, location, space, your answer, to 33121 for a chance to win fabulous prizes for the week. I wish you all the best. Six contestants are ready. Senior category, the preliminary round. Only two of them will make it to the semi-finals. Let's meet our contestants. My name is Fatima Suleiman from El Kenemi Schools, Borno State. How are you doing, Fatima? Fine. Now, if you're this tall, it's either you play basketball, volleyball. Do you play any other sports that uses your height? Basketball. You're on the basketball yes. team? Yes. How long have you been on the team? Mm, two years. And what position do you play? Forward. Forward. OK. I wish you all the best, Fatima. Welcome to Cowbellpedia. Thank you. Contestant number two. My name is Benjamin Chisom from Dorothy International Secondary School, Aba. Benjamin. Benji Benji. What do your friends call you? Benji. Benji. Any other one? No. For now. What do you think your friends like most about you? I don't really know, but... You're a nice guy. You like buying things for them. No, I don't buy things for them. You don't buy? <laughs> Why? <laughs> there's no money. It's not that like there's no money, but it's not good to spend money anyhow. It's not good to spend money anyhow. Very wise words, Benjamin. So how will you spend one million naira if you do get it? I don't know yet. But you won't spend it anyhow? Yes. I wish you all the best, Benjamin. Welcome to Carbopedia. Thank you. Contestant number three. My name is Thompson Alfred from Bellary Schools, Bayosa State. Great to have you on board, Alfred. Thank How you are you feeling today? Time. I'm okay. I'm excited. When you woke up this morning, what was going through your head about being here on this stage? Um, firstly, I was, reason I was like thinking of how I'm going to have my bath. <laughs> then for the, this, for the cowbell, I was like, okay, let me just get this thing over with. And, Let's just get it over with. Yeah. All right, Alfred, I wish you all the best as you make your way to the finals. Glad to have you on board. Thank you, Prince Master. Contestant number four. My name is Ajibola Fever from Bunde Secondary School. I like Baka Akure on those seats. Fever from Akure, how are we? Fine, Prince Master. Where are you from? From Akure. You're sir. also from Akure? Yes, sir. Which part of Akure? The um, south. The south? Yes. Uh, do you know your native dialect in that part, part of town? No, sir. Do you speak Akure? No, sir. Okay, don't worry, I won't bother with that. It's great to have you on board, Favor. So, what do you think is going through the minds of your parents at home right now? Uh, they will pray for me to win. And every time they pray for you, what happens? Something good happens. Something good happens. I wish you all the best and I pray their prayers are answered as well. Thank you, Master. Contestant number five. I'm Gina Lacan, Bethany Christian Academy, Plato State. Great to have you on board, Lacan. That name, I was almost tempted to call you Lacan. But that's like Plateau, right? Yes, sir. Uh, what part? 
Lang Tang Notes. I've never been there, but can you tell me one good thing about Plateau? The weather. The weather? Yeah. What's the weather like? So it's not so cold, not so hot, just more Just good. right. All right then, Lacon, great to have you on board. I wish you all the best. Let me, let me get a smile from you. You look like someone, you don't smile too much, why? Let me see a smile, come on. <laughs> great to have you. Contestant number six. My name is Ike Nami Christopher. I'm from Right High School, Asia. Christopher, how are you there? Uh, thank you. How old are you? 15 years. 15 years? Yes. And when you finish this secondary school of yours, where do you want to go to? Mm, Futa. Futa? Federal University of Technology, Akure. Why? Why that particular school? Because it is a school of technology. And what type of technology do you want to do? Civil engineering. Civil engineering. Fantastic. How much do you think you need to go to that kind of a school? I, I don't... You don't know yet? But one million naira will help, Sha. I wish you all the best, Christopher. Great to have you on board. Thanks. And there we have our six contestants in the senior category. Two spots are available in the semi-finals, but they have to go through two rounds. Round one, 12 questions. Five seconds to give their answers. The top three students from that round will move on to round two, which is the Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame. At the end of round two, we'll have our top two students with the total combined scores from round one and round two. When you do get to round two, for whatever reason, if there's a question you do not understand, just say skip and I'll move on to the next one. I've seen how that has saved a number of contestants on this show and how it has also ruined a couple of contestants on this show because they're not acting on time. Okay, do you have any questions? I wish you all the best. Congratulations once again for making it this far. Let's move on to round one, question one. The name given to the result of dividing two integers is quotient, dividend, divider, divisor. Five seconds to put in your answer. The correct answer is option A. Fatima, what was your answer? B. Alfred, what was yours? A, but I mistakenly... A, but you mistakenly pressed B. You see what I mean by accuracy? It's one thing to know the answer, it's another thing for the computer to know. Better luck with question number two. The rest of you got it right, well done. Let's move on to question two. If two raised to the power x minus one is equal to eight, what is x? A, two and a half, B, four, C, two, one over four, and D, five. Be quick, but also be very accurate. The correct answer is B, which is four. Alfred, quick time, quick time, quick time. Five seconds, put in your answer. No pressure. The game is still anybody's game. Question number three. Find the number of elements in a set of positive numbers not more than 25. A, 24. B, 26, 27, and D, 25. Sometimes I come across some questions that throw my contestants off the chart. And this is one of those questions. None of you got it right. Three of you didn't put in the answer in time and three chose the wrong option. The correct answer is D, 25. It's still anybody's game. Moving on to question number four. What must be multiplied by minus nine to make 27? A, three, B, one, minus three, or D, minus two? Correct answer is C, minus three. And your responses are a complete contrast to the last question because you all got this one right. Well done. Let's see if question five will be equally favorable. Simplify, two over three minus three over five. A, four over five, B, two over five, C, one over three, and D, one over 15.
Is question five as favorable as question four? The correct answer is one over 15. Option D, well done to all of you, well done. <laughs> question number six. Simplify, 0 0.25 raised to the power minus one over two. A, one over two, B, one, C, four, and D, two. Correct answer is D2. Two of you were very late in putting in your answer. The rest got it right. Let's move on to question number seven. Which of the following is solution two? 18 minus y is less than 14. Y is less than zero. Y is greater than four. Y is less than minus 14. Or Y is greater than six. Correct answer is B. Y is greater than four. Well done. Question number eight. Find x over y if 2x plus 3 divided by 4y plus 3 is equals to 1. A, 1 over 3, B is 2, C is 1 over 2, and D is 3. Answers are complete contrast to question 7, where all of you got it right. This time around, only one correct answer from Faber. Well done. Correct answer is B2. Question number nine. A man was 30 years T years ago. How old will he be in five years' time? 14 plus T, T minus 14, T minus 35, or 35 plus T. Silence in the audience, please. The correct answer is 35 plus T, which is option D. Congratulations to Alfred, Lacan, and Benjamin. That's cheese on Benjamin. Question number 10. Quadratic equation can be solved by the following methods except completing the square method, factorization method, substitution method, formula method. The correct answer is C, substitution method. Well done to every one of you. You got that right. Question 11. A housewife baked a cake. Two thirds of it was eating. If 500 grams remained, what quantity was baked? A, 350, B, 500, 750, or D, 1,500 grams. Correct answer is D, 1,500 grams. We had two incorrect, four correct. Well done. Question number 12. It's very, very, very tight. About three of you are on the same points. So this next question is very crucial. What is the least value of x that will be added to 169 to make it a multiple of 15? A, 3, 2, C, 0, D, 1. Three of our contestants are on the same score. But are they in the top three or the bottom three? The last question, question 12, we had five correct answers, one incorrect. But let's see what the final display is on the scoreboard. At the end of round one, 45 points, 30 points, and 25 points with Christopher, Fatima, and Alfred, respectively. Unfortunately, this means your journey on Calvopedia ends now. Thank you very much for your hard work, your persistence, and the fact that you've gotten this far. I look forward to seeing you in future endeavors, and I wish you all the best. A round of applause to them, ladies and gentlemen. Instantly dissolving cowbell milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita-Rich. Plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, deliciously creamy. Favor, Benjamin Lacan, well done.
How do you feel? The man from Plateau. You okay? Benjamin, what about you? Good. Favor? Yes. Are you ready to go? Yes, sir. It's round two, the Carbopedia 60 seconds of fame. You have 60 seconds to give me as many correct answers as possible in 60 seconds. I wish you all the best. If you do not know the answer to a question, just tell me to skip and I'll move on to the next question. You're all on 50 points. Chisholm, I'll start with you, followed by Favor, and then Lacombe. Are you ready? Yes, please, Master. Benjamin, your Cowbellpedia 60 Seconds of Fame starts now. What is the common difference between the terms of the arithmetic progression? Minus 4. Correct. Divide 8 times 10 raised to power 8 by 2. Four. Incorrect. Find the multiplicative inverse of 16 over pi. 5 over 16. Correct. The logarithm of 1 to base 3 is? Skip. God. Given that the first term of a GP to be 2, what will be the 99th term? Skip. Ada sells one tin of milk for 17 naira. Kunle bought 20 tins from her. How much did Kunle bought? 400. Correct. Which of the numbers 0 minus 2 minus 0 seven? and mi minus 7? Correct. Simplify 0 0.034 divided by two. 0. 2. Incorrect. What is the simple interest of 560 naira for two years at 5%? 5,600. Incorrect. 5,6. Incorrect. A union A is the same as? A union A compared to um, inverse asset. Incorrect. Solve for x if 0 0.25 raised by x equals to 4. 1 bar. Incorrect. Find the sixth term of the GP 5, 10, 20, 40, 80. 160. Correct. Well done. Chisholm, Benjamin, well done. Take a deep breath. It's not over until it's over. Let's see how the other two contestants do. Favor, you ready? Yes, we Wish you all the best. Your Carbopedia 60 seconds of fame starts now. Evaluate 1 plus 1 in base 2. 10 base 2. Correct. Calculate the equivalent angle to 500 degrees. Skip. The sixth term of an AP is 25. Find its term in the common difference is 5. Minus 5. Incorrect. In the logarithm of 1, 2, 3.4, the characteristic is? 2. Correct. Simplify A raised to power B, B raised to power X minus 1 divided by AB squared. Skip. Mr. Chuku gives 10% of his monthly earnings to his parents. If he gave them 4,500, find For 12,000. Correct. The standard form of 0 0.02. 2 minus 0, 3 times 10 is 1 minus 2. Correct. How many factors does 12 have? 4. Incorrect. 35 naira is shared between Ada and John in the ratio of 2 to 3 respectively. What is John's share? 21 naira. Correct. Round off. 241.8. 242. Correct. Evaluate. Log 0 0.5 base 2. Minus 1. Correct. If the set P is 1, 2, 16. 3. Correct. If log X base 8. A is for P. Sorry? A is for P. Correct. Find X if log 8 base 2. Correct. Well done. <laughs> Favor, Jibala, well done. That was a very good round. Jinan Lakan, you ready? I wish you all the best. Your Carbopedia 60 seconds of fame starts. Now, express 7.0753108 to two significant... 7.1. Correct. The ratio of boys to girls in the class is 3 to 1. If there are 9 boys, how many students are in the class? Skip. A car travels at an average speed of 45 kilometers per hour. How long will it take to cover a distance of 360 kilometers? 18. Incorrect. Uh, Make A the subject of the formula. Cube root of AC is equal B to... B cube over C. Correct. The distance D between A and B is not more than 200 kilometers can be written in algebraic statement as... A is, a is less than 200, less than B. Incorrect. If 3, 5, 35 base X plus... Skip. Solve the equation A minus 3 divided by A minus a 5. A is equals to 3 or 5. A is equals to... 3 or 5. Incorrect. Simplify minus 8 times minus 2Y times minus 3X. 48XY. Incorrect. If 6X minus 14 is 10, find the value of 5X. Skip. If A is 3, B is 0, C is minus 1, what is the value of A, B plus 2, C? Minus 2. Correct. Well done. <laughs> 100 points, 75 points, and 65 points. I only need two of you in the semi-finals. Chisholm, 
How are you doing? Do you think you performed well enough to make it to the semi-finals? No. Out of these three scores, which one do you think is yours? The 100, the 75, or the 65? 75. You're absolutely right. The 75 is yours. But you're wrong in the sense that it did get you to the semi-finals. So congratulations. Well done. <laughs> the man from Play 2. What's your full name? Jinan Lakan. Jinan Lakan. It seems... The only way you're going to get to the semi-final is probably in another competition, but not this one. Very sorry. You're on 65 points, which means your journey ends here. But you performed exceedingly and extremely well. We're very proud of you, and we wish you all the best. A round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Which means that favor, you're the man with 100 points. Well done. How do you feel? Good, sir. Do you think you were going home? Yes, good master. You thought you didn't make it? Yes, good master. I guess it was the tension. Yes. But you're quite fast. 100 points is not bad. The highest we've had so far, I think, is 145 points by certainly Emanuela. But um, this isn't bad. This isn't bad. Well done. Thank you, so Favor and Benjamin will see you in the semi-finals and you'll be joining Tamono and Ezekiel who qualified from the junior category. We'll be back after the break. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. That's youtube.com forward slash Cowbellpedia TV Nigeria. Stick around. Choco formula has been stolen. Get it back at all costs. Testing new Carbell Choco gives you the get up and go to be at the top of your game. Now with Vitorich Plus Iron. New great tasting Carbell Choco, a creamy chocolatey drink that helps give energy to get up and go. Here is the home play question for this week. The sum of the interior angles of any n sided convex polygon is expressed by which formula? A. N minus 2 times 90 degrees. B. N minus 4 times 180 degrees. C. N minus 2 times 180 degrees. D. N minus 5 times 180 degrees. Be part of the Cowbellpedia Best 11. Type SC, space, your name, space, location, space, your answer to 33121 for a chance to win fabulous prizes for the week. Season 3 has been living up to all the hype, all the expectations, and it's not yet over. Nine prelims, three semi-finals, and one ultimate final. It's been quite an exciting episode so far. Next week, I can assure you, won't be any different. Don't forget to download the Cabalpedia app from the Play Store onto any of your Android devices and get practicing. I am Oscar, your quiz master. Don't miss the next episode. That much I can tell you. Till next time, bye for now.